Hey Tracy, where are we going today? We're going to Dow Gardens to see the big bugs. Oh, okay, and Dow Gardens is in Midland, Midland Michigan, Michigan, right? Oh, wow, look at these beautiful plants here. Yeah, lots of beautiful flowers. There's the big bugs. Oh. oh, there's the first big bug. Yes, big bugs. So this one is a ladybug. We are looking for big bugs. Big bugs. And any flowers that we can see as well. But there nearby there is a canopy walk, which we once did, a children's garden, which we have we have never done. And the pines, which is like the residence of uh, the Dallas, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that's Herbert pretty Dow. cool. Herbert yep. Dow. Of Herbert Dow. The dad. So this way? Gotcha. Yeah. Cool. And then Alden Dow is his son who also built his home and studio right there on their property. Nice. Because this this used to be all of Dow, H.H. H. Dow's property. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, Tracy loves this place, in case you guys haven't noticed. Love, love coming here and writing. It actually was in my book. Which book was that, Tracy? Very Deep in Our Hearts. Very Deep in Our Hearts? Yes. Sounds like a very good book. People can find that on Amazon, can't they? They can indeed. Wow. And if you can buy a new copy, I would appreciate that. <laughs> yes, don't buy used copy because that does not support the authors at all. Not one iota. Look at this cool pond here. Oh, very cool. This is we mentioned before, yes. but we're on the hunt for big bugs. Big bugs. Yes. And every year they have different sculptures, don't they? They do. This One year it was Rubit the Exhibit. Yes. Okay, so this area is known as Streamside, and this is the water coming out after the waterfall. Forming a stream. Probably hence its name. <laughs> just how it oh, I think I see a bug up ahead. There's a bug up ahead? Yeah. Looks like a dragonfly or something, yeah, up further on the trail. Great place to take the family, take some kids, you know, teach them appreciation of nature. Well, it helped me when I was younger. I mean, yeah. And I left Midden and realized not every place has a place like this. Mm -hmm. you know? But the Dows valued um, nature, they valued education, and they <clears throat> gave their resources toward the community. So we're still in the middle of the little pond area here. Oh, it's a damselfly. Damselflies are aquatic, aquatic insects. insects, meaning they live near water. Damselfly nymphs are commonly found in marshes, ponds, lakes, streams, and other aquatic habitats. Adult damselflies have six legs, but they cannot walk. They use their legs for support while standing on objects or catching prey. Small bristles on their legs help them to catch a prey in midair. Oh, very cool. Did not know this. So that is a damselfly. We're at Dow Gardens. Yes, we are. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
I like that little garden right there. Yes. Here we are. Here's the assassin bug. Ooh. Right. Read how this guy does. I'll bet you it's something with that big beak. Assassin bugs are considered a true bug because they have piercing, sucking mouth parts. They do not chew. While some true bugs are herbivores, assassin bugs are carnivores, meaning they eat meat. Assassin bugs are stealthy, stealthy predators and use their piercing mouth part to attack their prey. So watch out. <laughs> Wow. So that's an assassin bug. Do, do, do. Beautiful. Aren't yeah. they gorgeous? Yeah. And we wish we could communicate smells to you guys. They are very fragrant. just one of my favorite parts of Dow Gardens. You would see half the sun on top of the water and then its reflection would be the bottom part of the sun and it would create a sun when you looked at the two together. Cool, I can kind of see it from here a bit. Isn't that cool? Yeah. That is by design, that's what he wanted. Hmm. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah. Okay, we're trying to find the next big bug and it's supposed to be a dragonfly. I oh. see it. Tracy found it. Cool. Oh, it's on the water. Isn't that cool? Yeah. <laughs> and there's a dragonfly. I think I see something. I think I see something. Cool. Oh. I see something. A big bug. Big bug. <laughs> wow, cool. Looks like a giant spider. It is. It's daddy long legs. Oh. Or at, which are actually venomous, but their little fangs can't pierce, pierce our skin, so. <laughs> yeah. also known as harvest men are more closely related to scorpions and spiders. They have two eyes and one body segment while spiders have two body segments and up to eight eyes. Daddy Lark, they cannot produce silk and therefore do not spin webs. There's many species of harvest men are omnivores eating small insects, plant material, and fungi. Interesting. That's cool. Yeah. I did not know that. I didn't either. Tracy found the ant. Found the ant. Which is another one of the big bugs. Big bug. Yay, it's right up ahead. Cool. Cool, it reminds me of them. <laughs> yes, the movie Them. The movie that... From like the late 60s or 50s, yeah. I think. There Let's are... take a close look at this guy here. Somebody's grooming in horror. 
<laughs> okay, to find one of the last ones, we're heading towards the canopy walk here. And we're going to find, it's I think a spider web, right? Yeah. Yeah, so cool. Here we go, there's the spider. All right, we just found the eighth inch bug. This is the last bug. This is the last bug. We just found it. It is a praying mantis, I think, right? Yep. Cool. Somebody's screaming in horror. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of spikes going on here, man. Yep. They're carnivorous insects. They are known as sit and wait predators. These agile masters of disguise utilize the art of camouflage to blend in with their surroundings as they wait patiently for unsuspecting prey. Spikes on their front legs help them to catch and hold their food. Lots hmm. of spikes going on around here. <laughs> okay, well, interesting that they don't say anything about what they do with their husbands. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> hey, thank you for watching this episode of Adventures with Dan Tracy. Uh, we really enjoyed our time here in Dow Gardens in Midland, Michigan to check out the big bugs. Yes. Yay. Yay. It's like an early Halloween here in July. <laughs> <laughs> but go ahead and subscribe to our channel. Give this video a huge thumbs up. And in comment section below, go ahead and leave any questions or comments that you might have about Dow Gardens. We appreciate your support. Oh, and something to remember, they change the sculptures almost yearly. Yeah. So if you come in here a, a different year, um, the sculptures might be entirely different. So um, don't be upset if they don't have big bugs when you arrive here. Uh, they might have some other really cool sculptures, so yay! yay. yay. And always remember, life, life is sweet for the bold, bold. so adventure, adventure with us on Adventures with, with Dan and Tracy. Tracy. Woohoo! Woo and it's a great place to take kids, as you can hear in the background. Yeah. <laughs>